Yo, what's the word? It's your boy 16. If you like the content on this channel, I want to ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click that bell for post notifications. Also, I got a website at www.16shotonvisuals.com. But that's enough of me talking. Let's get to what y'all came to see. So I had seen you say something like, you feel like hoes winning? Oh, for sure. You can explain that. Absolutely. These hoes is on top. Thoughts. The EP is out now. Definitely my EP is called These Hoes on Top. And my reasoning for that is because these hoes is on top. If you think about the most popular artist right now, the most popular female rapper, it's society standard. She a hoe. She popping pussy on a headstand. Motherfuckers is out here. Boot like... Everybody dressed like a stripper. Everybody throwing ass, shaking titties, all type of shit. They talking about fucking and paying for pussy, all type of shit. Whole shit. Thought girl, hot girl summer, all that shit. City girls are up 1,000 points. That's all whole ass shit. It's whole shit. And guess who's on top? The fucking hoes. They winning. So guess what? These hoes is on top, bitch. If, bitch, if that's on, I want to be that. That's what, ever, ever, like, all the girls look up to the Aries and the Jadas and the, you get what I'm saying, the Meg the Stallions and the Cardi B's. But in society, in real life, they're hoes. What they portray is a hoe. You get what I'm saying? When you talk about a oh, wet ass pussy, bitch, that's a hoe. You get what I'm saying? I'm not talking about their real life. Motherfuckers is married and have boyfriends and really just be on some other shit. But what they portray to the outside world is a hoe. <laughs> And they on top. So guess what? I want to be on. I want to be the hoe on top. What you think about like people like India though? Like, do you feel like she portrayed the image? India, what? Which one? The well, one that's uh, with the vent? Oh, India. Nah, she not no hoe. I, not that <laughs> I know of. She don't portray that at all. But do you feel like people look up to her too? Absolutely. And my thing is, this is my thing when I talk about hoes and I talk about bitches and strippers and prostitutes and all this. My thing is, I'm not trying to convince nobody to be a hoe or to be a prostitute or to be a stripper. I just represent for the bitches that's already that. I represent for the strippers. I represent for the hoes. And I represent for the prostitutes and the set workers and the bitches that's on OnlyFans. Like, that's who I speak for. I'm not trying to change nobody and say, oh, well, if you're a good church going woman, you need to throw that away and be a hoe. No, baby, if that's your life, that's the path you chose. Choose that path and live your life. You get what I'm saying? I'm talking about for the hoes, bitch. We already hoes. I'm just speaking up for y'all, bitch. I'm going to make a song for us, bitch. <laughs> I'm a paid hoe, whatever. Y'all bitches out here fucking for nothing. You know what I'm saying? I would just want something for us to say, like, this is ours. Like, oh, shit, bitch. I want you to not be ashamed of what you're doing. I want you to know, like, bitch, there's other bitches out here, too, that's doing what you're doing. And we doing what we got to do to fucking survive, bitch. So India, no, I love India. She's beautiful. She's conservative. She do her thing. That's her lane. I ain't trying to be no India. I'm trying to be a motherfucking superhead, <laughs> bitch. I want to write a book about all the dicks I sucked, bitch. That's what I want to do. And I want the bitches that sucked as many dicks as me <laughs> to motherfucking be like, damn, I love this bitch. She just so open with it. That's my thing. Like, I just want to be open where I want people to know and understand, like, bitch, there's nothing wrong with being sexual. There's nothing wrong with you using what you got to get what you want. There's nothing wrong. Like, bitch, it's just the path we chose and it's the life we chose and this is what it is. This is It's a part of life. Just like you got niggas that decide to sell drugs and you got niggas that decide to go to fucking work and be a car salesman. It's just the life you choose. You chose to be a drug dealer. You chose to be in beef. You chose to motherfucking go to jail. That's that's the life you chose. And even as a rapper, you chose to rap about that because that's what you've been through. You get what I'm saying? I'm a rapper. I'm rapping about the shit that I've been through. I've been stripping since I was fucking 15 years old. I'm not playing. I'm not that bitch. I'm this is just my life. I'm just rapping about it. You get what I'm saying? So I'm speaking for them bitches. And that's period. So, you know, what you uh, representing that, do you get, like, a lot of support from that com community? Absolutely. Absolutely. My hoes love me, bitch, and I love my hoes, bitch, period. <laughs> the hoes be like, bitch, I love that song. I be like, bitch, thank you. Like, 
<laughs> I'm also Jamaican, so I do that sometimes. I kill bugs with my hands. <laughs> Bitch, I'm from the islands, okay? I don't, little mosquito don't scare me. But, um, no, I get a lot of support from the bitches, from the community, from the hoes, from the strippers. Like, the strippers love me. The hoes love me. Bitch, I get messages every day. Like, yo, that song, bitch, that's me. Like, I'm that song. And I'm like, bitch, me too. I'm glad you felt that way because that's the reason I made that song. Because I wanted you, I wanted people, females that, it's my thing. When I make music, I feel like when I was younger, I ain't have nobody to look up to. I ain't have nobody to learn the game from or to, you know what I'm saying? Like, I want to be that person that my younger self would have been like, oh my gosh, she doing what I'm doing. She went through what I went through. She, you know what I'm saying? If I had a me when I was 15, bitch, I probably wouldn't be even be where I'm at today. I probably would have transitioned, been transitioned out of whole wisdom. But bitch, I ain't had that. Bitch, I'm figuring shit out, learning shit. I'm fucking money up. I'm doing all type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I want to be that person that a young girl look up to and say, damn, that's me. Damn, I could, you know what I'm saying? Open a business. I could start a business. I could, you know what I'm saying? Invest in some stock. I could do something and use the, my pussy after I make the money that I make and invest it and get the fuck out of this business. Young. Because if I would have knew the shit I know now when I was 15, I promise you, I probably wouldn't even be sitting here with you with the camera. Bitch, I'd be somewhere just, you know what I'm saying? Real, I know so much now, but I had to, like, live it and go through it and learn it. But, bitch, I'm trying to help everybody out. Bitch, I'm not trying to keep y'all being hoes. I'm just trying to help the hoes, you know what I'm saying? And then the people that is living it, like, I just feel like you just, sometimes you just want to relate to somebody. Like, damn, bitch, I went through that last week. You feel me? Like, damn, somebody feel me. It, that's me. I feel you, girl. I was there. I sold that pussy, too. God damn it. <laughs> you feel me? I did. So guess what? You ain't not here alone. You ain't going through alone, bitch. I've been through it. My homegirl been through it, bitch. We all been through it. So, you, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes people just need that person to say, damn, I know what you're going through. I feel you. And that's it. And that's what I want to be. Did you have somebody like that uh, for you that you looked up to? Absolutely not. And that's why I pride myself on being that. I never had that. I looked up to people and they were just so perfect and everybody was just so this and that. And I just thought I was living my life completely wrong. I'm just like, damn, what am I doing wrong? I'm crying. I'm, You know what I'm saying? I'm so over certain shit because I never had nobody to tell me like that's regular like you going through this right now but everybody goes through that you get what I'm saying I didn't have that so I want to be that for the girls to let them know like listen whatever you're going through bitch that's normal we all go through it we all have been through it we didn't have to get there and not been there and whatever the fuck it's just a stepping stone it's just a hump you get over it and you get on with your fucking life you know what I'm saying I never had that, so I want to be that for my girls.